Good day YouTube. This is just a bit of a quick and fun video all about how to do the BMW blender test in Linux Mint. Now the reason why you might want to do a test like this is to test your CPU, see how fast it is, measure it up against friends machines, that kind of thing. But it's a very popular one so why not show you guys how to do it there. Now first of all you do need to have Blender installed. So in order to do such a thing you would need to go to a terminal and type in the following sudo apt install a blender. Whoop, I have spelt that wrong. Try that again. And there we go. Now, that's happened really quick for me because mine's already installed, obviously, there. But you'll need to take a moment to follow the prompts and install that one. Once that's done, you do need to next uh, download the BMW file. And you'll only find that through the Blender website in the demo files page. And there it is. So you'll click on that. It will be a zip folder. Just save it to your downloads folder and then extract it. And once you've got that one there, all you need to do is go to File Open on Blender. Let's pretend that I don't have this yet and jump across to the BMW 27 CPU. Now there is a GPU option. Let's just keep this video simple and go to the CPU, open that one up, and then we want to render it. And the whole point of this is to see how long it takes to render. So we go to Render, we go to Render Image, and then it starts to slowly but surely start rendering. Now, this will take longer than the video could ever be, so you won't see the full completion of mine. This is actually on a virtual box with only a couple of CPUs, so this would actually take some time. But uh, let's see, we can see it's running at uh, 20 seconds so far, building 1%, 0% through, not very far through at all. In just a moment, you'll see that it starts to render, here we go, the first couple of uh, squares there. The reason why there's two squares is because I've got two virtual CPUs running on this machine at the moment, so it tends to do it two at a time. It will look something a little bit like this behind us, but a lot more high resolution, a lot more refined. Uh, there's lighting, the camera angle, everything slowly but surely gets rendered there. But something little, uh, a little bit of a fun thing feel free to post your results in the comment section below how long it took for your machine to do so it's always a bit of an interesting one and people seem to really love this this cpu test across the board so so why not so a lot of fun like i say thanks for watching guys please leave a comment subscribe hit that like button and thanks again for all your support and i hope to see you in the next one